You have a question? Oh yes, I have an answer. Hello, hello. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. We are back again for another episode of Ask James. So let's get to it. Hey, my best friend in my head. I have an issue. I am not and have never been homophobic. I thought. However, I am newly single and have been dating. I met a guy and we kind of hit it off. Well, I decided after a few weeks of dating that it was time to open the chokey jar. <laughs> the chokey jar. The cookie jar. <laughs> oh my gosh. To open the cookie jar. Woo! Long sigh. I went to his house. Everything was going well. He had drinks for me and the whole nine yards. While watching a movie in the living room, we started making out. It was great. We retreated to his bedroom where the wonderfulness continued. We had a jolly good old time until this motherfucker turned over and tooted his ass in the air and said, lick my ass. I got that for its rocks look. <laughs> Who the fuck is this nigga talking to? So as I immediately started putting my clothes on, I started to wonder if I was maybe homophobic to a certain degree because seeing his big ass 250 pound fool with his ass in the air just did something to my soul. Help me, friend. What does that mean? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, and I want you to listen close. You're not homophobic. There's nothing homophobic about what actually transpired here. Um, this is about choices, okay? This is about choices, and I'm going to tell you, I am gay. And I ain't eating no ass, and I don't want no ass eaten. You understand? For me, that is just not my juice. That's not how I get down. That's not ever been a desire of mine to play either part of that. That is a function that I don't care for. I don't even th ass eating is not. It's not just a gay thing. That's just a people thing. And again, like I said, this has to do with choices. It breaks down to choices. Now, what you didn't do is have enough conversation before you decided to open the chokey jar, <laughs> as I said earlier, because you all didn't actually spend enough time, I don't think, talking about what your likes and your wants and your dislikes and your taboo situations were because uh -uh. and I could and 250 pounds baby no sir no ma'am no 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 honey and I, yeah that would have been a deal breaker for me too and I would have been putting my but not only would I have been putting my clothes on baby I'd have punched him right in the small of his back honey and fucked him up eat what if it didn't come from Popeye's honey So, no, this had nothing to do with homophobic. No, I don't think you're homophobic. It is what it is. If you sign up for a straight man, then that's what you expect. And there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. If you didn't sign up for a bisexual man, then you shouldn't have to settle for a bisexual man. That's just fair. That's fair. And if somebody doesn't like it, to hell with them. You know, that's not... You know, that stuff, there, there needs to be, you know, times have changed, you know, and people were not, people aren't hiding everything the way that they used to. These things need to be talked about. So, um, again, now I'm going to have to smack your hand, too, because, again, more talking, more time 
before you give up the chalky jar. So, you know, you need to, these, and now that you've actually had this, when you know better, you do better. So, you'll know to have these conversations going forward. Mm -mm. Baby, I'm not going to lick your ass. Okay, so I don't want you to turn it over and put it up in my face. I'm about to cut you. You know, have the conversation. You, you'll know now. But yeah, you did the right thing. Get on up out of there. Get on up out of there and be gone. Because that's a mess. Mess, 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 mess. That has always been for me taboo. A lot of people like it. I'm not mocking them. It's cool. You eat all the ass you want. <laughs> okay okay all right you guys you have something you need to get off your chest or something you need some help with I'll give it my best shot send me an email to spillitboy at gmail.com and in the title line you want to put hey James to make sure that I actually see it if you don't put hey James in the subject line I'm not going to see it it's going to continue to be an issue. So send me an email and we'll talk about it later.